There was a bit of debate on Bible verses today in Parliament. My point of order is this. The Bible verse that he's talking about is general. I'm talking about the Bible verse that is specific to Israel. Thank, thank you, Mr. Speaker. Member of Nuku, Joe Sungi, questioned the Foreign Affairs Minister on the United Nations vote on whether or not America could place their embassy in Jerusalem and why PNG voted against it. Can we ask the minister to explain to the rest of the population of this country why this country has voted against the very nation that, it's, that it has got up, that it has a Bible right here with us and we believe in that country because long Bible later we talk about Genesis 12 and 3 and we talk about someone who said he supported or cursed Israel will be cursed. Foreign Affairs Minister Rimbig Pato responded saying his decision was not based on Christian principles but on foreign policy. Uh, let me also say that the decision to vote in the way we did was not taken lightly. It was based on professional advice which was received uh, from our mission in New York and also uh, from the department. And it was not a decision based on Christian principles. It was a decision which in accordance with our foreign policy, that is to remain friends of all and enemies to none and we have to the minister also had a Bible verse to further explain reasons why PNG voted against USA. For our nation, we need to look at the, the legal decision of the UN, which has remained since 1967. That is, that Israel must live in peace. And the world, this globalizing world, is about peace, prosperity, and security. And we cannot isolate one Bible passage when we must look at everything in their proper context. The Bible itself says, love your neighbor as yourself. That's what the Bible says, doesn't it? The minister said PNG isn't voting against Jerusalem, but against the United States. And the decision we took was not a vote against Israel. Not at all. If you think that it was a vote against uh, Israel, then you have been misled. It was a vote against the United States of America and the position we took was the same position that was taken by some of the closest allies of the United States of America. Athlete Xerox Kari National, MTV News.